real quick video on my uh, in hotel room quick and easy and dirty shooting range. Uh, so when I travel on business trips, I normally bring a uh, an decent assortment of BB shooters. I generally have my A plus BB frame with uh, Theraband black tubes or bands. I also have my Cherry Metro Grade Good Titan uh, at 100% size with the uh, dip latex tubes 0.125 that uh, you can get from uh, Metro Grade Goods. And then uh, I just received my 80% HDPE, uh, I think it is half inch thick. Uh, oh, Joe Lumbri Titan, or as my son dubbed it, the uh, the Tiny Titan, also with the 0 .01, 0 0.125 dip latex tubes. Uh, these tubes are a little bit longer active length than my uh, normal Titan. But the the shooting range I use, uh, this is something I I did last trip. I just simply put a pillow, and in front of that put a coffee disposable coffee cup or even one of those uh, plastic drinking cups you can get in most rooms. Uh, the only downside is a lot of, some rooms uh, or some hotels are now going to glass drinking cups um, or also for coffee cups. Uh, I don't drink coffee, but this is a perfect use for these cups. One thing I do is simply put a pillow in, in front of a wall or um, in this case, you know, wherever will give you decent shooting distance in the room. And I'll, sometimes I'll put that inside of a garbage can or just leave it as is. One thing that I've noticed is that the cup itself, if you take the wrapping inside, make sure that's nice and loose, uh, so it can generally stop the momentum of most of the BBs. I say most because there will be some that will tear through one of the layers here, poking a hole and causing some of the BBs to simply drop down onto the floor underneath the cup. Uh, generally speaking, depending on the band setup, it won't go through both sides. As you can see, we'll have some BBs trapped in here. Uh, these were shot with uh, with both Titans. I haven't shot the A plus yet this trip. Uh, but if that if BBs going through becomes an issue, this can be easily set inside a garbage can with uh, newspaper on the bottom to act as that uh, dampener to decrease the likelihood of any bounce outs. Um, which is also good, uh, so you don't leave BBs lying around the hotel. And the one thing I do recommend is not necessarily using the copper colored BBs. As you can see, they kind of match the floor a little bit, so they're a little harder to recover. Um, so if you do that, definitely keep an eye on your BBs. Scour the room before you check out. Uh, I'm not sure what uh, if uh, there would be any repercussions from shooting a slingshot inside a hotel. I haven't had any so far but uh, that's just me. So if you're gonna do this, definitely get something that will stop the BBs. Um, and also I would recommend using the non-copper coated BBs as they'd be easier to find, uh, depending on what the flooring in the hotel looks like. I just happen to have the copper coated ones uh, when I travel and have a lot of those on hand. So that's what I'm shooting right now. But anyway, this is my quick and easy and down and dirty setup for in hotel room thinking. Hope you all found this uh, informative, and if you all do some any, tr any traveling and you want to take your slingshot, this is a great way to continue shooting, shooting during business trips or who knows, family vacations if you can get away with it, uh, whatever your trips may be. Maybe down at the, a, a tournament in a hotel and you want to do some uh, BB blinking at, during the evenings if you're not too tired from shooting during the day. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed.